Elliot, very unlucky today, so close to getting a point. Um, what do you put it down to in the end? Uh, I, I don't know. It was, it was, you know, the weather was, it was very hot, and I'm not making excuses, but I think it's very tiring. And um, it could have gone either way. I think. Mm. Uh, I think a, a draw would have been fair, a fair result for both teams. But uh, unfortunately, this time we're on the receiving end of uh, uh, a loss, which isn't, which is not good. Tell us about playing in this heat. I'm standing here now at whatever it is, quarter past five, and it's yeah. still absolutely red hot. Yeah. What's it like to play? I I, I, it's not just the heat. I think it's, it's with the astroturf and mm. your feet are burning, and it, it is hot. And then obviously the heat rises from from the rubber, and it's. Just, it is very hot and that's why we're having breaks at 22 minutes and obviously half time and then 67 minutes is breaks and it's hard to keep your concentration when it is so hot but it's not an excuse to why we lose 2-1 today. Well it's on a personal level, we saw you get the number 10 shirt in the summer, we've seen you play as a holding midfielder ever since really, um, yeah. enjoying it, you seem to have developed a new tenacity and aggression to your game over the summer, is that a fair comment? Yeah I think I think that's one thing that uh, the gaffer likes about me, I'm quite versatile, I can play Four, eight, ten, seven, and I think that's that helps him out with you know when people like Walks are struggling with injury, and you know if someone in the ten isn't doing as well. But obviously I've come in, I've scored goals, I've got assists, so I think you know I'm doing my job for the team. It's just making sure I'm doing the other side of the job, which helping get the clean sheets and stopping goals, which. Uh, you know, I've got to do the same end, so. I'm not asked you about that goal the other week. I mean, <laughs> how many comments did you get on social media about that one? It was unbelievable. Yeah, I think that's just it's just habit, and you know, I've always had that side of me where sometimes we're just gonna have a crack, and it just sat up nicely from the throw in, and uh, why not? You have to, you have to you know, be in the uh, raffle to score, don't you? So. <laughs> I know you're obviously disappointed to lose this one today, but when you look at it overall, 1-2, drawn 2, lost 2, yeah. it's it's a pretty good start, isn't it? Yeah, well, considering we've gone up a level and we've pretty much got the same team, um, you know, and I don't think we've been far away in any game. There's no team that's blown us away at all at this mm. level, and I don't think there will be all season, uh, and, I, and I stand by that. Um, but I just think there's these little bits and bobs where last five minutes you've got to hold the ball up and stretch them into what they were doing to us type of thing and that's what you, you've got to do at this level um, to see out games and you know we'd have been happy with the 1-1 it's a tough place to come but uh, in the end it comes down to concentration and I think today we just lacked it a little bit last 10 minutes. If you could put your finger on one thing that is different about this step up about this level what, what would it be? Uh, I think it's just the physicality like, yeah. I think obviously um, last season a lot of our goals were, were set pieces and um, that comes down to quality as well from, from me and Ben but, uh, and Sam but I do think that you know they are better defenders at this level so I think you know you score more goals from open play and that's you know I don't think we score a set piece yet but every goal we score pretty much every game and it has been from open play so the only thing I'd say is probably physicality um, but I think you do get more time on the ball I think that's one thing that, that is good um, but I don't know, I don't think it's a massive step up to be honest with you. I've played at this level before and yeah, I don't yeah. think there's that much difference. I, I, think I find this level a little bit easier to play at than yeah. uh, the Conference North, but that's just individuals. There's 500 county fans here today, there'll be plenty more of course on Monday for the visit of Chesterfield and that's, I'm just saying to the gaffer there, it, it's got, I don't know, it's got that football league feel about it, doesn't it, Chesterfield visiting county? Yeah, of course, well that's two ex-football league teams and I think, um, you know, you know, the county faithful will always be home and away, so, you know, we've got to stand from support all the time. Um, obviously, Monday's a big game with Chesterfield coming, I think there'll be a big attendance and we've been bank holiday as well. You know, a lot of people off work and stuff like that, so hoping for a big crowd and a big win. Look forward to it. Thanks, Cheers, man. Thank you. Cheers, mate. Well